back to our channel. So today we have these really cool Roblox figures to show you. That was sent to us by Jazzwares. So we've been sent a game pack from Murder Mystery 2, a six figure pack from Apocalypse Rising 2, a core pack from the game Tower, Sim Tower Defense Simulator, and two Series 8 mystery figures. But we're only actually going to open one on this YouTube channel, and we're going to open the other one on our Instagram. So head over to Love Rora if you want to see what our other figure is. Okay, so which one? I want to open this one. Yeah, but that's really... I really want to open one of these, though. They look really fun. Let's do this one. No. I think we should... I, oh! I just stabbed my finger. Look at that. So the cool thing about these Roblox... All the Roblox, all the Roblox toys. Is that they each come with a little virtual code. No, I'm saying the wrong bit. <laughs> Say <laughs> my line! So the cool thing about all the Roblox toys is that like everything you get in that package is part of the online virtual Roblox game. And these package, well I think, yeah, all the packages come with this virtual code which you can scratch off and you get an exclusive virtual item. A horrifying crime has been committed. Will you be the one to catch the culprit? Dun dun dun. So this comes with 10 pieces, two figures and some accessories. The figures have names. Pop them out. Okay, okay. So we have a little... Oh, look at this. <gasps> oh, I love look! Ra's this, got a present. Oh my gosh, look at that. There's like so many. Can you even see all that? There's like, look how many characters there are to play. They look so cool. Okay, we've opened up the Murder Mystery 2 figures now, and we've got Nick here and Illis there. And they're actually so cool. They're really good because like they're all, they're jointed everywhere, so they're like they're jointed cool. at the knees. So you can make them look like they're walking. <gasps> oh, these would be really good for stop motion. The, the head that comes off, and then you can arms turn move, the, head around. the hat moves, put it back. <laughs> the head on moves. Her head. So quite cool. So you can mi mix and match. Right, pass me, pass me her hat. Her hat. Yeah. She can look. Really? Okay. So. Oh yes. <laughs> Angry girl. Oh, well, you can't see her hair. Her hair. Her eyes. <laughs> Maybe she can put it. So if you haven't played Murder Mystery, it's basically set around a crime scene. And you're either like the sheriff or innocent or the murderer. And then obviously like if you're innocent, you've got to try and not be killed. And then the murderer will like try and kill you. So it's sort of like a runaway game. So you get a mystery crate with like a, a weapon stand a weapon on top stand. of it. And then so we've got one of the other accessories, which is this really nice like copper skull knife. So just yeah. pop, pop that. Well done, <laughs> congratulations. Um, you also get one of these little, um, I'm going to call them another accessory because I'm not quite sure what they're called, but they just slot into the back of the figures like and that. then you can, if I do this the right way. And then you can put the knife in the back like that pop. and then they can like. Well, how come I can never do it? Oh, her Which head. way? It's because you're left handed. There we go. <laughs> left handed. Right, no, I'll do Problems. Um, voila. Voila. And you also get these really cool guns. So look, this one's golden, which is nice with like a little blue strip on it. And then they like, just slot easily into their hands. I say easily. Oh yes, easily. Pew pew. So this is like the sheriff's, oh, the sheriff's weapon, and then right, the um, yeah. murderer's weapon. If you haven't played the game before, basically you get these crates, which you can like collect around the map and stuff. Pew pew. <laughs> and you get the crates, and inside the crates are like items and things that you can obviously gain. What have you done with the knife? It goes that way. So Ra's logged into the game and she's going to redeem this code. So I'm just going to pop it on there. Scratch away. Wow, this code's really long. Right, Ra, I'll read it to you. Pop it in. Right. Oh, what's something happening? Okay. Aha. Right. Three, one, five, three, five. Three, one, five, five. One, two, three. One, two, three. Eight, five, three. Eight, five, three. Double one. One, one, one. two. And now, redeem. 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 You have to successfully redeem, redeem knife lover hat. hat from Roblox. Oh, that's so Ooh. cool. Look at that. Look at that. So next, we're going to open up one of these murder mystery packs. So which one? And then the other one's going to be on our Instagram. So this is the Mystery Figures Assortment Series 8. Um, we've taken off the plastic now. There's a little flap. So that's nice and easy to open. And there are 12. There's 12. And there are 24 new figures to collect. Oh, that was easy. Oh, it just split right down the front. Ooh, okay. 
His head's twisted back to Got another. <gasps> oh, yeah. Oh, cool. Okay, wait. Check who we have. Oh, we've got another redeem code yeah, thing. Yeah, and you get cool. another code with each of your, like, little thingies. Ah! Ow, ow, ow. some help. <laughs> Let me do it. You're going to break his head. Poor guy. I don't know if it goes on further. I don't think it goes on further. I do. Oh! Okay, so it turns out his legs can turn into <laughs> llamas. <laughs> oh my goodness. So we have Agent Jonas from Hotel Stories. We haven't actually played that game, but here he is, looking quite cool with his silver gun and his mop of black hair. <laughs> I like his shades. But what I've noticed um, about this is that he's got, obviously, holes in his feet, but I think this is actually stand because he sort of slots on there quite nicely. That's quite cool. And we also got a pile of spiders from the redeem code. It says it's a hat, but it looks like there's all what was sitting on your shoulders. <laughs> okay, so now we've got this tower defense simulator guy. So this, we've actually played this game and it was, we, we sort of, we got the hang of it. So you basically have this little army that you can spawn and then you have these waves of zombies that come and attack you and your army has to like try and survive the wave. It's quite fun. Good game. Out of the box is our little dude, so he's got his like little mouthpiece, he can talk to his army, or he might even be in the army, be defending against those zombies. He's got a hat which comes on and off, he's also got his little like green outfit. He's also got this really cool gun, look at this. Which fits in his hand. Put that in. Oh. It doesn't slide down. Hang on. You shouldn't slide down, they push in. I think they push in better. Can they just slot in yeah, like that? Yeah, look at that. Why do I always make weird sounds? <laughs> this is huge, guys. It's like a double barreled machine gun. <laughs> no. What sound does this make? <laughs> <laughs> okay, yeah, well, it spins. It spins. Um, The guns go like all the way around, so they're like fully. Fully. Spinnable. Spinnable, okay. <laughs> Um, and it also turns like that to help him get away with all his guys. There's some like discoloration or like bad paintwork just at the top, but to be honest, it doesn't really matter because it's a gun, so it's okay. Um, let's slot these in. He actually holds this, which is so cool. It's actually quite hard. This is quite stiff. I did it earlier. I actually managed it. Yeah, one hand's in. I don't want to break it. There we go. That's in. Ready? And then he can pew pew. Oh, he can't move it, can he? Wait. Aha! There we go. <laughs> there we go. He can move that now. Sure. And it can. It turns with him. Well, I think he's turning it. Yeah. Look. Yeah, I know. But like, me. That's funny. <laughs> and this is what Ra. Ra's redeeming all these like exclusive items. Yeah. Look. So this, I've got a portable sentry. Which is kind of weird because it's kind of a hat. Like, it's a that. gun on my head. <laughs> it's like a tripod or something like that. And on it's my head. from Star Wars. Da, da, da. And now we have Apocalypse Rising 2, you know, six figure pack. Here we go. Um, this is actually a game that we play. Let's open it. This is actually a game that we play quite a lot. It's one of the ones you have to pay for. I think it's 300 Robux. But it's worth it because it's so much fun. <sighs> It's kind of like, this box. you've got to survive in a world that is like weird sort of meeting that's trying to kill you. It's an, I, I think, think they're called infected. Yeah. People are infected that try and like, I don't know why they're like, this side. Yeah, I know. Just check there's nothing else in that box. So these are all of the figures and they are actually awesome. You also get this background, so don't destroy any of the packaging because you can like use this for play or like stop motion. This is actually in the game. This is like the bridge to different like sort of islands on the map. So really we need to glue it, but it will be okay. But we can like... You can put your figures on here. They look kind of cool. <laughs> They're in the ocean. We can name them all. Can we? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we can. I think. Oh, we... they've got names in the box. Yeah, hang on. Let me just get the box. And then we can show you, like, there's... Oh, oh me! Okay, so this guy is one of my favourites. So he's a, he's called the Plague Doctor. And he's obviously, like, got, got like, one of those Black Death masks. Yeah, and then you ready? Mwah! Oh, Ooh. man, he's down. See, look, his face, it, that's what the infected look like in the game that try and kill you. Yeah, I, like, maybe, I don't know. It like, seems weird, though, because, like, he's the plague doctor. He should be healing people. And he's, like, yeah. 
Maybe I it's wonder like... if you find him, he like tries to get you. Yeah, or something. And maybe if you kill him, you get something special. I don't know. We really want to find this guy. It'd be kind of interesting. Okay. And then this he's got is... the motorcyclist. Oh, he's down. So he's got his like he's got his visor, which oh my goodness, everyone's falling. So he's got his visor, which comes up and down, so you can see his face, <laughs> which is kind of cool. He's got his like motorcycle leathers on, it's like a nice deep. What? You... He's dead. <laughs> It's gone. Okay, well, he, we can do him next then. Okay. So, let me just put your gun back, mister. mister. So, he's like, he's like a pilot, RAF. Right, so this guy I quite like, because he's like a pilot. He's got a parachute um, on his back. Um, I think I put his gun round back to front. Like, so clever. Look yeah, at that. he's shooting back at like, all the guys who are going to fall down in a minute. So, like, look, this guy... This guy, he's got like a parachute strapped to his back, which I really like, and he's, he's got, got like, like his badge, the insignia on there. And then he looks kind of cool. His face, I love is it. Is that the funny face? It makes me laugh. Yeah, his weird like. <laughs> you can put your gun back. Sorry. Okay, now we've got the ghillie sniper, who's like he's literally dressed up in like bush, I found him. camouflage. Where yeah, I found, Ralph found him the other day. I found him, and I found him by the beach. And like, he was kind of dead, I think. Why was he by the beach? Shouldn't he be I don't in, like, know, he bush? was on the sand, and he was by the beach. I oh, think he was dead. Mate. So I literally got that gun off him, I like collected that off him. That's kind it of was cool. actually a very good gun. Okay, so. now we've got the bi- this bio- oh my goodness. This biohazard dude. So he's kind of cool, he's like bright orange, full camouflage gear. Ca camo? What, 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 what? Protective gear. Um, so he's got a crowbar, he's actually the only one that doesn't have a gun, so poor you. Um, he looks pretty, he pretty, he's like, he's sad, so I don't know, maybe he's been infected. We, we figured out that because he's like a biohazard person, he might be near the plant, which is a place on the map. So we were thinking, hey, let's go there. And then... Oh, I should have looked when I found this bush guy and saw where he was on the map. But I didn't do that. Oh, yeah, you should have checked. And this guy, I quite like him as well. He's in, like, camo. He's got, like, a sniper gun. Look at that. And he's got, like, some, like, maybe night vision stuff to help him, like, shoot people. Or, like, sure. fine vision. He's quite cool. Look at him. He's, like... He's, like, military. He, he looks His tough. head looks green. We just noticed that. It's kind of like, is he ill? Maybe, it's maybe okay. his face, it looks like a pain smile. Maybe he's like dying. Yeah, I know, that's what I was thinking. He dying looks like he's like in awkward pain or something. So, <laughs> poor you. All pain is awkward. <laughs> so this is what the code gave you. And instead of like, a hat, it's actually a bundle. So that's really cool. So if can they click this and then like find out like what we get. <gasps> look, so I think. Wait, we, why is my. We think that you get like. Wait, click on it. All of this click stuff. It. Click what? Click on it. See what I get. I have a seal on my head. Yeah, look, you get to wear all of this. Ooh. You can wear that. Well, I like my cat mask. My Wi Fi is really bad down here. Yep. <laughs> but, like, basically, you get the idea. So, first up, thank you so much, Jazzwares, for sending us this Roblox collection. They're actually awesome, and you can buy all of these at like major retailers such as The Entertainer, Smiths, Argos, Tesco's, Amazon, Sainsbury's, any of those. So we haven't actually had mystery boxes before, but the lovely thing about these is that if you collect all of them, all of them you end up spelling the words Roblox. So we've got like both the O's, so we've got like the little tilted O and the non-tilted O. Which is really cute. So the game sets are really cool because you get to like... You get everything that you need to be able to play it, like, uh, the game's offline. Yeah. And I love that um, in the six pack you get a background which you can, like, display all your figures on, but like, the background relates to the game. So, like, this is the bridge that you're trying to run across to get to different mm, islands on the map. So, if you are a Roblox fan and you are absolutely going to love these, obviously, like, whatever games you play, you want to collect, like, the ones that you want. But we think they're all absolutely awesome. Thanks for watching our video, don't forget to subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Bye! Which one's your favourite? I like this gilly good. I was going to say dude. And the plague doctor. Why don't, why don't we start streaming our games?